Hello and welcome back to yet another break here on the channel. Uh, as promised in a previous video, uh, the Panini uh, kind of retail break I did, we do have Panini Prism 2020. So I'm not really a huge fan of the blasters for Panini, um, but I really do like the kind of like value packs, most because I really like the red, white, and blue parallels um, and stuff. So I really like those. And then if I see a mega box, I'm probably going to snatch one up. Uh, I've just been a big fan of one. Uh, I've had a couple that I've opened. Uh, I'm actually going to grab them real quick. Hold on. Probably should have done that before I started recording. But I do have uh, several autos and good cards I pulled. So I got an Isan Diaz uh, out of one. Uh, numbered one of 50. Uh, that was pretty big. I really like him. I know he's been signing a lot, but I'm a Marlins fan, so I like that. Edwin Rios, 6 of 50. And we have Kyle Garlic, got a 44 of 50. I think it may be one of those I pulled out of a blaster. And then to have a Jason Martin, um, not numbered, which is fine. And then just had a couple numbered cards, Buster Posey, Justin Verlander, and then there's that Kristen Stewart uh, rated rookie I bought. Uh, excuse me, I got out of an optic previously that I didn't record, of course. But, uh, we do have guaranteed auto, um, on average, so, <laughs> that's, I hate that wording, that it's like, oh, you might not get one, but, uh, um, but yeah, just gonna go ahead and, um, crack it open. Uh, pretty, pretty happy with, uh, the Mega Boxes, especially, like, when you have, like, other Topps products, um, you know, like, I was thinking about, like, Gypsy Queen, uh, Mega Box, and, like, Heritage Mega Box, uh, like, yeah, you get some different parallels and stuff, like exclusive stuff, like Chrome cards, but you, you don't get, like, a guaranteed autograph. And again, all the autographs I pulled out of here are sticker autos, which I'm not a huge fan of sticker autos. Uh, but, I mean, I love the on-card stuff, but still, a guaranteed auto for even just even, like, I think this is, like, retails for $38, um... Or something like that. I think it was like Walmart I bought it at. So it might be a little cheaper if you buy it at Target or something like that. But even with that, I just I just really like uh, the guaranteed stuff. Even though it doesn't have the logos, all that stuff. So here's all of our packs. Um, I might actually start with this. Start with this bonus pack. Mostly because our big hit is probably going to come in one of those. So I do like these parallels uh, that come in the... Um, mega boxes as well. Like, I really like some of those, like, Carolina Blue. Um, there's kind of some of the others I really like. And again, talk about it in the other Panini Prism video I did. Seeing these on, on camera and stuff, they're like, ah, oh, whatever, those look cool. But seeing these in person, like, even just looking from my screen to actually seeing them in person, uh, there's just, they just look beautiful. A little bit of a line there. I don't know if you can really tell, like, right there. Uh, on Joe Palumbo. Let's start off uh, with these. Eugenio Suarez. I want to say these are the Carolina Blues. Brian Abreu. You have a Juan Soto. Varez. Yelich. Brilliance. And these are really cool too. George Springer. Justin Dunn. Rookie. And there's a Bo. Bo Show. It's probably one of the better cards I've, I've gotten out of these bonus packs, so that's really cool. And we're going to start into uh, the main pack, see what we can pull. Maybe we can pull uh, that auto pretty soon, and maybe, no, I don't think it's on this one. George Springer, Justin Dunn again. There's Bobby Witt Jr. top of the class. Got him and an Adley Rushman now, so I really like that card. Put that on the screen. That's pretty cool. Yeah, still got baseball. Uh, hasn't been canceled yet as of recording this video. Um, but I just feel like we might get a little bit into the season and it might just go downhill. But there's Keston, Stroman, top of the class, kind of like refractor look, Bryson Stott, and Yelich. Um, but yeah, I mean, hopefully things are going well in your neck of the woods. I know it's still kind of crazy out there, but again, I, I'm just so thankful that baseball's here to kind of keep us together. Leba, yeah, there's a Gavin Lux kind of refractor look. I don't know if 
Prism has their own kind of different words, but uh, that might be one of the best cards I've gotten out of that and a Luzardo rookie. So I'll keep I'll keep those on there. A little bit more of a seems like more of a bend to the Gavin Lux than some others, but um, yeah, pretty happy with that right there. Um, I'm selling some good cards on eBay, kind of making some money back to buy more cards and do more videos. So I've been pretty pretty happy with that. Here we go, you know, Henio Suarez saying hello. This is probably going to be numbered. And it is 10 of 35. And I apologize, I don't 100% know what the name of uh, this is. But again, just looking at it on the camera, it looks like one thing. And then you just see it in person. And it just looks so beautiful. So already, a, probably one of the best mega boxes I've had. I, I have not gotten those kind of cards out of a mega box yet. I mean, at least, you know, other than the autos, they've usually just kind of been kind of dull, I guess, cards. I mean, I had the Posey um, kind of like mojo look, but I think it might have come out of a blaster. Not sure. Sean Mania, Sonny Marte, Sixto, and Javier Baez. Uh, we got some new releases coming out soon. We do have uh, stuff that just came out. Obviously, Optic just came out for Panini. We do have Topps Chrome coming out beginning of August, I believe. So pretty excited about that. We got Bruce Dar, David Fletcher, Taylor Trammell now on deck. Anthony K, rookie. We are down to the final two packs. So we better get our on average auto. So we're going to find out if it's coming soon, but we do start with the bow. Two bows, a bow and a lux. I really like that, and I think our auto might be here. So there's Bo Bichette. Happy with that. Take the back card. Jose Barrios, and I think this might be our auto. We're going to rotate it. We're going to flip it. Three, two, one. Ty France. Uh, sticker auto for the Padres. I uh, will admit, I don't know too much about Ty France. So if you're from California and you're like, wow, I really like that card. Um, there he is. So not numbered, which is fine. Uh, looks like third baseman, number 11. But yeah, there's our auto right there. Get that sleeve top loaded up. And last pack of the Mega Box. Uh, let's see who we can hit. I mean, we've got the bow. We've got the Lux. I mean, I guess like maybe an Aquino we could hit who's really not playing this year. Gio Urshela, Clint Kershaw, top of the class Corbin Carroll, and there's a Shohei Illumination. So, uh, pretty happy with uh, what we got here tonight. Um, you know, I'd open plenty of other Mega Boxes and blasters and whatnot. I don't think I had gotten one bow or Lux. Um, so I got the stargazing bow and this regular rookie. I got this top of the class Bobby Witt. And uh, don't forget this uh, crazy Eugenio Suarez um, thing out of 10 out of 35. Please comment below if you know what exactly this uh, kind of parallel is. Just look at that, man. Look at this. That's so cool. Uh, anyways, uh, let me know what your thoughts on Panini are. What, what kind of big release coming out are you excited for? Uh, but until then, we'll see you next time. Goodbye.